Please. You eating? You eating your food? Please, In the kitchen with Esipo, and we're gonna be filming what my nine month old eats in a day. And a lot of you guys asked for this video. It's so funny because I didn't even know I was pregnant with a lot of you guys, you know, when I was pregnant. So I posted my I think what I eat in a day um video like two or three weeks ago, and a lot of you guys asked, please, if I could film what is eats in a day, because I know how frustrating how um confusing it can be you know figuring out what to feed your baby especially when they are growing from like eating only maybe milk and breast milk to now eating real food i'm going to share everything he eats in a day his um, snack his breakfast lunch dinner is actually is not that big into food he's still into his breast milk like we still fight over breast milk up till today and I think I'm going to give him to you maybe one year, you know, that should be like the highest I can go. Okay, so Ace is relaxed here. I'm actually using Masha and Bill to keep him seated because he, he likes getting everywhere. But yeah, Masha and Bill is on. He's watching a movie. Well, I will go ahead and quickly prepare his breakfast. And most mornings, guys, what we normally start off with is, of course, breast milk because you know, like around 5.36, he joins us in our bed and he just wants to be on the breast, you know, till whenever it is I wake up. And then I make him some scrambled egg and depending on what fruit I have in, in hand, whether I have avocado or, ma or banana or mango, you know, any fruits at all. He's actually very, very heavy in fruits or, or strawberries, you know. He can only finish just one egg just a little just for taste nothing nothing much and a little bit of milk to his egg i like to use just a little bit of butter to fry his egg kind of glaze the pan I like to cut just half um, a banana, like I said, he's not a heavy eater, so just half a banana is always um, enough for him. His high chair comes with a plate, so this actually makes it so easy for me to use for him because sometimes when you give him plates, right, before you turn, he already kind of threw the, the plate on the floor. So I love the fact that this comes with a kind of a detachable plate, daddy. You ready? Mmm, yum yum. Yum yum. And his pediatrician advised me to kind of give him his food and allow him pick it up and eat. Of course, he's gonna, he always ends up making a mess, but it's okay, you know. I'm gonna go ahead and clean it up when he's, when he's finished eating. But this is actually called um, finger foods, you know, food he can easily just pick by himself and eat. I just keep it and allow him eat and um, deal with the food. Mmm, so good. So good, right? Nana, some juice. So I usually give him his um, juice. This is um, apple juice, baby apple juice. It's good, Daddy. Mmm. Please. You eating? You eating your food? Mmm. Nice. 
<laughs> okay, now it's time for making a mess. I'm going to take out the plate. You're a whole mess. A whole mess. So we are back after Ace took a nap. Daddy, how was the nap? It was good. Mm -hmm. You know, once you take a nap, you become bored. Mm -hmm. Let's have our snack. Mm -hmm. All right, Daddy. Mm -hmm. Now you want to eat your shoes. Oh my gosh, that means you're hungry. Let's put this on because that's the only reason you didn't mess up your clothes in the morning hmm? with all the mess you made, he made a lot of mess with that um, egg and banana right I'm definitely gonna link a video to this um, particular recipe up on this video but I actually filmed a video with Ace when we made you know I showed you guys how I make his puree food so this is his puree food right here as you all can see these ones are blocked so what I normally do is in the morning I go ahead and bring out you know the one I want to feed him for the day so we have carrots here we have pear we have um, I think mango and then we have banana right here so I have apple sauce I brought out apple sauce for him today I'm gonna go ahead and feed him because he can't eat the apple sauce himself and for the rest I'm gonna go ahead and put them back into the freezer ready to eat so good mm. Yum yum. So good. Yum yum yum. Mmm. Right, Daddy? Mmm. Mm. when you're feeding a baby you have to exercise a lot of patience like they have their moods right daddy mm -hmm. hey Sipu and also chewing shoe. Those two don't go together. Okay? Hi, your view. Hi, your view. Just let me have the shoe. Thank you. Mm. So good. So, so good. Right? It's so good, right, Daddy? Mm. Come on. Apple sauce. Yay! Yes, Daddy. Yes, Daddy. Hmm? Ah! 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 Since the mouth is open, we're just going to pass the food inside, right? Oh, no. Oh, no. finished though. Hmm? Just one more spoon. Last one. He came back to his, to his um, high chair. I'm gonna go ahead and prepare mashed potato. But with this right here, I'm gonna be using the sweet potato, not the regular white potato, because he's not a fan of the white potato, guys. I notice he really um, enjoys sweet potatoes. Actually, babies love mashed potatoes a lot. So if your baby likes the normal mashed potato, of course, 
you can go ahead and you know make the normal one but this one likes the sweet potato sweet potato actually for me personally too yes daddy yes but can i talk please thank you but me personally i also like the sweet potato because i guess because it's sweet right daddy what time is it it's time for lunch I'm gonna quickly wash it up. Yes, daddy. Okay, so I'm gonna bring the potato to a boil. And with this, you want it to be as soft as possible. I like to make it mashed potato with some broccoli. So I'm just gonna cut a little bit of broccoli for him. So it will be kind of a side with the mashed potato. I'm gonna add the broccoli inside the same pot with the mashed potato. Here is how the potato looks. I'm just going to add it inside a bowl. Butter is really going to make it very, very creamy. And also butter adds a very nice taste to the mashed potato. I'm going to add a little bit of black pepper and um, seasoned salt. Just something like that. It's okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and just mash it up. And this is so good guys because it's very very easy for the baby to eat he doesn't have um, a lot of teeth yet so something mushy like this is way to go you know when you have a baby i'm going to take off the one i will feed him right now just something like this is perfect then i'll add two broccoli inside if you don't want to serve the baby the broccoli just like this, you can go ahead and mesh it. Sometimes I like to mesh it, sometimes I like to just serve him like this. We're gonna transfer from here to here. Right, Daddy? Hmm? That is actually not hot. It's not hot. It's very good. Is it yum yum? Mm? Yum yum. It's mashed potato and broccoli. Mm? This one I would have left him to eat himself, but he can't. He doesn't know how to eat with a spoon yet. So all the spoon ones I have to feed him. Oh, so good. Daddy, it's food. And then the broccoli, I just like to kind of mesh it, you know, I cut it and then I mesh it with the sweet potato. Nice. Mm, my baby is eating, you know. It's so good. Ah, woo! Yeah, 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 this mashed sweet potato and broccoli tastes so good, guys. Mm, so, so good. And why I like to boil the, the broccoli with the mashed potato is so that the sweetness from the mashed potato can also penetrate into the broccoli while you're boiling the two together. So it literally makes it taste very good. And then the butter, the salt, and the pepper makes everything taste really, really good. Mmm. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. It's so good. Right? It's so good. Mmm. He's even sucking his lips. Mm. I bite him. Mmm, 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 Daddy water and some water. Okay. Good. So 
good. Mmm. You did so well. Mm? Your water. So whenever Ace gets hungry in between lunch and dinner, I always of course make his cereal. I make sure I give him his fruits and vegetables and also I make sure I, I feed him some cereal. So I have this um, GABA um, oatmeal banana cereal and I also have this um, cereal like He actually loves his cereal like So I'm going to quickly fix him his cereal like And also I have the milk. I'd love to you know, make his cereal like and also add some milk inside. And to add his meal, I'm going to use a little bit of baby water and mix the cereal. So I just microwave it just for five seconds, just to make it a little warm. So this is the only milk S likes to drink, and then I have the. Um, cereal and then cereal like Daddy, ooh, ooh, ooh. Mm. bless you mm. he likes small small portions of food so that way he can eat different meals but he's not the too much of eating type it's kind of sample he likes to sample food mm. So today I think we're going to be eating pounded yam and okra soup. I already have the water for the pounded yam, you know, boiling and I brought out the soup um, earlier today because you need the soup to defrost. I'm just going to quickly make dinner. I'm going to warm up the okra soup, do my pounded yam and that's what he's going to have for dinner. Like I just, I give him his special um, meals, you know, during the day and then at night. Whatever it is we're eating, he eats with us. Guys, look who just had his bait and is ready for bed. Hey, Sipu. He hasn't had breast milk all day, so he's literally mad. Daddy, see the camera over there? I'm mm. right here with you. Mm? We're just gonna have dinner. Dinner right here. Dinner. Yeah, hey, see, yes, yes, let me wash my hands. Mm? That's why once he starts dragging on my clothes and everything, you know, he's looking for breast milk. But daddy, there is dinner right here. Mm? We can do breast milk later, okay? Please, please, AC boo. Please, daddy, boo boo. Aww. Oh, that's my baby. When you feed them, you know, constantly, like whenever you feel like, oh, they need that breast milk, you feed them, you will notice that they're not going to request breast milk as much as they normally should. Mom? Oh, I see boo boo. I see, I see boo boo. <laughs> My baby is enjoying our cross soup and fufu. Mm? Oh, this is, oh my gosh, I made a huge mess. I forgot your story. And then the worst part of it all is that he has white on. So 
That would be a serious thing with all this palm oil. AC, AC, boo boo. Yes, my African baby. This shows your proper African. Hmm? African baby eating African food. Hmm? Delicious okra soup with pounded yam and shrimps. Right? Right? I love about okra soup is the fact that it's very very easy to go down the truth like back home in Nigeria right if you're winning a, if you want to win a baby off from um, breast milk or like their early food okra soup is just what um, our grannies that's what they always advise because okra soup is very easy to go down the truth because it's, it's draw you know they call it draw soup because it draws so it's so easy for babies to eat I know See how he's downing this food. Real African baby. Mm? Nice. Mm? Daddy, can you leave the beef alone? Why you keep messing with this beef? Oh, you don't like it. Sorry. Okay, I remove him. Cheers. So I can be contemptuous sometimes. It's out. Yeah, he's getting frustrated. He wants breast milk. <laughs> Daddy, look at your whole face. Nothing is working now. You want your breast milk? Mm? All right, you guys. I guess this is where we're going to end today's video because is I think he's sleepy. All right, you guys. I hope you all found this video helpful. Please don't forget to hit that like button below and also hit the subscribe button. Just hit that like button because of is because. I think he did so well with his um, meals today. And till my next video, I will see you all very, very soon. Essie, hey, say bye. Essie, hey, say bye. Say bye-bye. Bye, guys.